Hey everyone, it's Courtney. Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing something that I got requested for and it's something that I used to do in my videos a long time ago and I haven't done one in a hot minute. So today we're going to be doing a grocery haul. So I myself tend to shop at a local chain store called Market Basket. It's kind of popular in New England. I'm not sure their whole reach but I shop at Market Basket, so everything you're gonna see here today is from Market Basket. So here is just like a quick view of everything that I got. I use their recyclable bags just because I like to be green. I really love this bag that they have. It's so pretty, isn't it? I love it. So first off, I do wanna say that this isn't a full-on grocery shopping. Um, I tend to go grocery shopping once a week and I did a bigger grocery shopping last week, so I didn't need a whole lot like what I normally would grab, but I just wanted to show you guys what I picked up, and yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy. My hair right now is crazy. I'm looking at it in the screen, and basically it's like this crazy because it's kind of like a warm day, and I figured I would put like the moonroof down in my car, you know, slide all the way back and just, pretend I was in a convertible for a minute. So yeah, my hair was just flying everywhere. It was like a 1980s white snake video in my car. But that's why I have this lovely hair going. Yeah. All right, so here is just like a quick little overview of everything that I picked up. So let's get into details. Right here I have a six pack of chocolate chip muffins. And down below I have a six pack of blueberry muffins. These are two, no, three twenty nine. dollars um, They were on sale last week for $2.99, but no more. Right here I have a little over a pound of 80% ground beef. This was three eighty six. dollars Right here I have a little over of a two pound chuck boneless pot roast. So I'm excited for this. I love a pot roast. This was six fourteen. dollars Next thing that I have here is two of these Milford Valley chicken cordon blue things. I like these just when I don't feel like cooking dinner at night or maybe like lunch or something. They're just kind of nice to have in the freezer just for those type of days, you know. So I like these. Like I said, I got two of those. Next thing I have here is some white cheddar nuggets. A little artwork on here is so funny. Um, but yeah, it's just like these little like cheesy poof type things. But I like these. These are really good. Next thing I have here is three things of the Minute Rice ready to serve. I like these because they're already like pre-served out kind of. Um, they're easy to make just like a minute in the uh, microwave and you're good to go. So I have two of these that are plain and then this one right here I figured I would try. Um, this is the fried rice. So it's a new and improved flavor so I've never tried it so this will be a first. Next thing here, I have two bags of vinyl all-purpose gloves. These are 50 cents a bag. You get 10 gloves in it. I use these at work. Next thing I have here, I figured I would try. These are sugar-free Hawaiian Punch singles to go. Um, this one is Fruit Juicy Red and Berry Blue Typhoon. Um, I've never tried these before, but they were 99 cents a box, and there is eight packets, so I figured I would give that a try. I like having those for work as well. Next thing I have, you can see I have one here and one here, two of the Sunbelt Bakery strawberry um, fruit and grain bars. I love these for breakfast in the morning when I'm working. It just makes it something simple and easy that I can eat on the go. Next I have something naughty that I shouldn't have bought, but whatever. This is the Duncan Hines Chewy Fudge Brownie. So, yeah, this is when I need my chocolate fix, which, yeah, gotta have my chocolate fix. I have a gallon of milk here, and I know that people are probably going to ask, now mind you, I shop in New Hampshire, I don't shop in Maine. Um, this is $2.39 or $0.49, I want to say, so it's actually a lot cheaper than Maine milk. Next thing I have here is a Market Basket Premium Raspberry Lemonade. It kind of caught my eye. I love lemonade and I haven't had any in a while, so there we go. Right here I have a bag of sesame seeds. I plan on making some sesame chicken in the crock pot, which I already did a video on, so I'll have a link for that down below. Go check it out. 
Next thing I have here is three packets of this chow mein stir fry sauce. It is from Blue Dragon, and I absolutely love this. This stuff tastes so good. So I have three of these. Next right here, I have a package of the Kraft Singles White American Cheese. Just like to have those on hand. I picked up two dozen eggs because they were on sale today for 99 cents a dozen, which lately they have been a lot more expensive than that. So I figured I would stock up, grab two dozen, so I should be set for a while. Next right here, I have three Granny Smith apples. I love these to death. They make for a great snack at night when I want something sweet, but don't want to like go for something naughty. These do the trick. And last but not least, I have two containers here of the Chinatown lo mein noodles. These with that chow mein sauce, oh my god, it is so good. I might even do a video showing you guys how I make up my noodles because it's so simple, so easy, and it tastes like restaurant quality. I'm serious. So I have two of these. Alright guys, so that is everything that I picked up for groceries today. I know it's not a whole lot compared to like some of the videos I used to do, but I kind of wasn't planning on it until I just got a request for it and I didn't need a whole lot today, but maybe in the next few weeks once I start to work through what I have, I'll do a larger grocery shopping and I'll show you guys more of what I get, more meats and stuff like that, things that I make for dinner and lunches and stuff like that, but I figured this would do for today. So as always, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. And until next time, I will see you later. Bye.